eight. I don't mean to eavesdrop or anything, but this Sarah? Is she a dancer? She's a phenomenal dancer. I think I met her earlier today. And I mean, she seemed, she seemed like a nice girl. Best girl that guy's ever met in his life. That's the biggest mistake he's ever gonna make. He's a fucking moral. But hey, you know, I waste my advice on these people, you know? Sounds like a prick. No, I know, I'm a bartender. Seems like you know a lot. I know this. You meet a girl like Sarah, smart, intelligent, driven, but you put a ring on it. You do anything you possibly can to hold on to it. What you don't do is break up with it. That was a Ryan classic. That was a Ryan classic right there. It was ridiculous. I couldn't believe my eyes. It was literally perfect. Yeah. Ryan, it was just like fifth grade, dude. Seriously? It was just like fifth grade. Speaking of which, scrunchy. Scrunchy? It was just... It was just like fifth grade, man. It fifth was grade. Yes. Yes. Fifth grade. Yes. You when never you forget that time. Of Person How face. Can I forget? It was imprinted Christ, into that my was memory. Like over ten years ago. It's one ago. of my core memories of you. Like what it would be? Shirley Temple. Actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Never mind. What was going through your mind? Why you two polo wearing fuck bags want to make ten bucks? Hi, Mom. Elsie, honey, I'm so happy you answered. I'm so happy you called. How's your business trip going? New York City. Wow. It's really good. Um, Actually, uh, a lot of meetings with higher-ups, a lot of happy hours. Um, I've been really busy. Look at my working girl. Way to go. Yeah, you know, I'm actually, I'm, I'm a little busy right now. I got a lot of work to do. I gotta go. Oh, oh, no problem. Good night, sweetie. So proud of you. <sighs> Pretty depressing, Will. Yeah, you might want to do some more comedies. Yeah, <laughs> I have a long list of comedies. Come on. But I'm not really in the mood to laugh. Yeah, well, I know a lot of filmmakers and they've all been dumped. <laughs> yeah, well. Add me to your list. I figured. I just stood there. I let her walk out. And I keep thinking to myself, if I... If I'd realized what was happening like 10 seconds earlier, I could have put up a fight. Or at least... No, maybe convince her to stay. I've loved her more than I've loved anyone else. Do you love her more than you love film? She wants you to give up your whole world. You can't, it's not, it's not you right now. You can't give up your creativity, but you have a choice. Do you want to make art? Or do you want to subject some girl to being second choice? Now, if I had a contract for the Yankees right now, do you think you'd take it? I don't play baseball anymore. Oh, yeah, then why are you swinging that imaginary bat all the time? It's an itch. And you try to scratch it by swinging an imaginary bat all the time. You're a talent, kid. I'm not just saying this shit, Will. It's through your talent. Don't give it up because you want your heart to hurt less. What, is this like an intervention? Hey, take this shit seriously. Don't waste your time making the same mistakes everyone else does. Yeah. Thanks, Fred. Uh -huh. Always being real. Mm -hmm. Never hold back. Mm -hmm. You need to go to Prague mm -hmm. um, to get away. It's like, oh, I could be in the family plan. Suddenly, we could have me. So, Prague it was. Prague, Prague. Oh. <laughs> hey, honey. Stop. What are you doing? Stop. Stay, I'll get, uh, I'll get us drinks, okay? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. 